Tonight, we're learning more about the two men accused in a bank robbery in South Columbia yesterday afternoon. We're finding out one has a lengthy criminal history. Good evening. I'm Daniel Winnin for Joey Parker. During our 5 o'clock news tonight, we told you prosecutors filed charges late this afternoon against Vincent Soto of Kirksville and Joshua Harrington of Columbia. Soto is in the Boone County Jail on $150,000 bond, while at news time, Harrington was being processed by the Columbia Police. ABC 17's Lindsay Burning has been looking into the pair's criminal hat past, and Lindsay, these two have been in trouble before. Yes, Daniel, both have been in trouble recently. In fact, I found out today Soto violated his state supervi supervised probation just two days before the robbery happened, and he was listed as a fugitive of the week by the Kirksville Police Department earlier this month. Soto had a list of arrest warrants in Adair and Macon counties. Police say he stole a stretch limo from a dealer in Kirksville and led police on a high-speed chase in late December 2012. Documents from both counties show he was arrested shortly after. Adair County sentenced Soto to five years probation in July 2013. Since that time, he allegedly violated his probation for missing a court appearance, consuming methamphetamine, and more. And Boone County Sheriff's deputies arrested Harrington back in early August for resisting arrest. He posted a $4,500 bond a couple days later. In court documents I got today, police say Harrington has a history of domestic violence, drug use, and theft. Both men are expected to make appearances in Boone County Court tomorrow afternoon. All right, thank you very much, Lindsay. The court documents we obtained today show the pair rushed into the Missouri Credit Union on Buttonwood Drive right around 5 o'clock yesterday. One of the suspects even made it behind the counter and started opening the teller drawers.